that's a pretty sight, isn't it, guys? Yeah, it is. We're at, uh, I don't know where we're at. We're on, we're on the parkway up uh, above Groundhog Mountain, I think is where we're at. One of the overlooks. A little hazy this morning. You know what? I think it's time for a beer. Let's go see what's in the fridge today, guys. Hello everybody, thanks for stopping by Greg's Beer Reviews today. Today we're on location at Apocalypse Animal Works here in Forest, Virginia. We've got two of their beers we're going to try today. Uh, the first one here is the Apocalypse Imperial Red Ale. This beer comes in at an ABV of 8%. The description says, Aroma explodes with citrus hops and does not stop. Hops in the beginning, middle, and end. Hopped as much as a double IPA but perfectly balanced with Munich malt to give both hop heads and malt lovers the best of both worlds. So, here's what it looks like in the glass, guys. I've already had a sip or two. It's leaving a very nice lacing in the glass. Very orange tangerine in color, fairly clear. Let's get a nose on it. Very strong hop presence in this beer. Very citrusy. Very floral, very herbal. Real nice hot presence. Smells like it's got a real nice malt backbone with this one too, guys. Yeah, so let's give it a taste. Cheers, everybody. Very nice. A very nice balanced beer. And for one coming in at 8%, I'm not getting the alcohol at all, so that tells you that it's a well-made beer. Very pleasant. Very citrusy. Very nice. <laughs> Look at the lacing that it's made on the glass. Very impressive beer. Got the beer and then came out in the street. Should I, is inside? This is a, this is one that you can tell by, the, by how balanced it is that it is, that it is a very well made beer guy. So, we're going to let it warm up just a hair, let her sip on it, we'll come back and we'll do the final jug. Stick around. Alright guys, welcome back. We're down to the final chug here. This is the Apocalypse Imperial Red Ale coming in at 8%. It's very tasty, guys. It is a very, very tasty beer. For an Imperial Red Ale, I'm not giving any of the alcohol. I tell you that it's a well-made beer, guys. Very tasty, very balanced, very hot forward, very citrusy, very tasty. Y'all have a good afternoon. Definitely worth picking up if you're in this side of town. Uh, they haven't got this bottled or canned yet, but. Definitely worth stopping by here. Apocalypse Ale Work or Brew Works. Final chug, guys. Yes. Very tasty red ale. Probably one of the tastiest. Probably be on the top ten list of red ales. Very nice. Especially as fresh as it is right here. They brew it right downstairs and serve it right up. It's awesome. It's very tasty. Now, so, if you're in the forest area, Lynchburg area, you need to stop by, give it a taste. They're planning on canning this stuff hopefully by the end of the year, and it'll be uh, distributed in the stores. So look for it if you're if you're into the red ales, guys. So uh, I would probably give this one. I would probably give this one. Probably give it a seven, a B plus on this one. So it's definitely worth. Trying if you can get your hands on it. As always, rate, comment, subscribe, and let's go see what's in the fridge.